artist, you know, is Cool Melody, Live in Living Colors. I've been born and raised in the island of Bermuda, raised as a song boy, one step away from the streets. Yeah. Now I'm there to represent Touch Tune Studio in this project called the Bermuda Times. And the Bermuda Times really, as a youngster coming out of high school, I used to stop at Dub City and buy records. And then after that, I got the equipment after, at the records first, <laughs> you know what I mean? So slowly I got into the, the music industry. I used to play sound in my neighborhood. I used to go down to the dock, to the beach. When the school's out, make, take the school and turn it into, into a dance hall, you know what I mean? Well, the main artist that inspired me was Lit, Little Kurt and Beanie Man, because that was the first DVD I ever had, was Beanie Man and Little Kurt. And that's how I got the name Little Corbin at that time. Okay. I did my first recording in 89, 1989. It was with Dub City. A man called Daddy Ronksy came to recruit, recruit me to do an album with Dub City. And that was my first, the first time I knew that somebody was looking at me as a singer. Otherwise than that, I was just like a, a backyard singer. Well, life was pretty pleasant as a youth for me. But as you get older in Bermuda and you enter into the system, that's when life became challenging to me, getting chased by the police and little minor minor things in Bermuda can um, kind of, in your youth, it can kind of um, give you a challenge, you know? Well, true still, I have enough feelings for the reggae music and it's some good feelings. It's good inspiration and in reality, that's, that's my whole foundation revolves around reggae music. So, I see positiveness in the reggae music, but it's a lot of other elements that are rising up and overshadowing the reggae and the love that comes through the reggae. But I, I find like-minded people like myself who came into the business like in an entrepreneur type of way I feel that it's a lot of support from these people for us to establish in the ranks of other music and to benefit financially I think that's where the fight is some of the older mu musicians I, I would suggest that you don't give it up you keep you um, publish your product push it out there is just to give the youth inspiration to let them know that you uh, you have been through the roads that they are trying to travel now. Well, I've performed in um, St. Lucia, Antigua and Barbuda. I've performed in Jamaica for the Studio 150th anniversary. I performed in New York, Biltmore Ballroom. I've performed in Atlanta in a place called Peacock. That's the place down in Atlanta. But I feel we could get good reception in Europe and UK as a Bermudian. I've been to UK in 2011 and, and it seemed like everybody I ran up into was interested. And some people don't have knowledge at all about Bermuda. Some people don't know that Bermuda exists. So I feel like it can be received well if we get the right launch pad. You know? I think the government can do a lot more by setting up relations in the industry with other industries that are already established. Like merging with the Jamaican industry. Because Jamaican is, his whole background and tourism is, is sitting on the foundation of reggae music through the father Bob Marley and others like him who established this music. Government has a lot to benefit from the reggae artists in Bermuda and elsewhere. The whole industry period, I feel like the Bermuda government can benefit, but I don't think they recognize this. I don't think they, they can see from where I'm sitting, you know? I think the people, they can do research and keep up with the, the reggae business. Don't lose interest because it's not too much other things that you can really embrace and earn as your earn as a part of your culture. So the reggae music is one of those things and it's a and it's a good 
reach it's a good avenue to reach the youth if the people of Bermuda embrace it and don't be ashamed of your your, your culture because it is a part of your background I think it, it would do a lot for the industry itself my advice to the troubled youth is to look back and remember where you come from so you can understand where you're going there's no need to to sell out on your culture there's no need to follow fashion and everything we're just coming along that comes and goes you know because we are we are humble people as Bermudians and and we'll always use the foundation of reggae as far as I know in my time so the youth coming behind us there's a lot of things that into that you you don't understand where they get it from where in, they must be influenced outside of Bermuda or through the television because in Bermuda we, we are humble people well as an artist I see myself heading onto the forefront of the, the industry because Bermuda is in a sense undiscovered and the people that do know about Bermuda I'm, I'm sure that they would like to see Bermuda on the world stage because they, they have, they, if you know about Bermuda, you've had a unique experience. I see myself heading to the forefront of the music as long as I have breath. I'm gonna push forward in the music because I know even if it's not in my time, I'll still be around to help people coming after me to get, if this is not accomplished in my time, to make sure that it is accomplished within the youths coming behind me. In 10 years time, I see myself as, as a manager, managing artists, or even a promoter, promoting artists. Because right now I'm, I'm building up links to the world stage in different parts of the world. Whereas if I take an artist under my wing, it's, it's in the bed to protect him from the, the pitfalls that I've put into myself. Because I, I can see a straight, a straight road. You know? What you might not know about Corbin Melody is that I'm a hard working one. You know? From a youth, even though you see me get chased by the police and all them things, it's like, we never really do no high crime, but the police treat me like criminal. So, outside of that, me as a humble man, I lean on the good part, of the good in things. I look for the good, I don't dwell on the negative. Me have like a overwhelming love for people, you know? And we want to see people do the best that they can and, and be the best that they can, you know? Yeah, but this one is on the Touchstone label. Bermuda Times Project. This is for all the girls, then. You want you slow your roll, you know? Girl, you got to be careful if you want to get respect from a man like me, you know? <laughs> you us see it. All right. So she figured out that it wasn't no one to fill her heart. She should have dissed him from the start. My lady, I wanted to be the one. Do you remember when I told you so? Baby, just let him go Cause if you really wanna be with me Then don't say no Girl, you just can't go in around With every guy that hit the side You just can't do it like that No, 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 no Girl, if you want respect Gotta be able to keep those guys in check Until you meet somebody like me Who loves you, lady Girlfriend I say you gotta be careful. Say you gotta be, say you gotta be, say you gotta be careful. Yeah, you know, I touched the studio over there, you know, it represent for the fullness. One love, Bermuda. You can contact me through touchstonestudio.com. And I'm here right now producing a song on the Bermuda Times rhythm through Touchstone Studio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lady, lady, so you figured out that there was no one to fill your heart. You should have just been from the start, man. I wanna 
wanted to be the one Do you remember when I told you so? Lady, just let him go Cause if you really wanna be with me Then don't say no Girl, you just can't go in and out With every guy that hit the sand You just can't do it like that No, 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 no Girl, if you want respect Gotta be able to keep those guys in check Until you meet somebody like me Who loves you, lady Girlfriend I say you gotta be careful I say you gotta be I say you gotta be I say you gotta be careful yeah, yeah.